Okay, here is the boat that's for sale. It's a 1978 Cherubini design 130. I've had the boat for probably four and a half, five years. It's can use a little bit of, I just washed it off, hasn't been washed off in a while, but the deck could use a little bit of elbow grease. There's a stanchion broken off right here. And actually I just had the Dodger redone, but it got torn when uh, we had a problem with it. So anyway, the plastic glass part of it is basically brand new. Uh, and the rest of it just needs to be restitched, probably re reattached. It has, I don't know if you can read that, two speed 40 Lumar winches. And I replaced all the all the fittings here. The uh, fuel, the waste, and the water all new. Okay. Well, the hole's not in bad shape. Um, you know, the glass is a little bit oxidized, but it's not too bad. It has really heavy, heavy stays. I replaced all the ports with these newer style plastic and stainless, and they're all opening. I have uh, screens tucked away inside. Okay. This window hasn't been replaced yet, but I have the plastic. I actually replaced the other side. Let me show you. And I have the other window inside the boat if you want to replace it so there's the other window I put screws every stainless screws every couple inches and I used a silicone adhesive marine grade to attach it and it's dry okay here's a I guess it's a seven foot inflatable it's about two years old and that's included in the sale of the boat and then there's a uh, lightly used but it's been out in the sun a lot a uh, kayak it's a one man sit on top kayak all the paddles and everything are still in the boat okay let's go in the boat here's how the boat runs. Motor's in real good shape. Starts like that every time. Uh, really economical. It's a two-cylinder Yanmar. I don't know if you can hear me on it. I can idle it down. The engine runs good. It runs really well. Idle it down so we can go inside. really really well we repowered it it came with a one cylinder Yanmar and we installed this two cylinder we have the manual too so if there's anything needs to be done you just follow the directions in the manual it's real simple Shut it off so we can so you can hear me talk. Okay. 
we redid a lot of the bright work in the boat and the upholstery is in pretty good shape so I put in a stereo the speakers probably need to be replaced um, what else can I tell you here's the chart table I had a little fun with it and went and had this redone I did redo it at home actually um, here's the galley need some formica which I have I have a burgundy color formica which I'll throw in with the boat uh, the sink is new all the carpet and stuff that goes around the boat is new the doors are all in perfect shape I had a friend of mine he spent hours and hours and hours working on these drawers and doors they had knobs but we were getting caught on them when we walked by so I had him drill out the knob hole and then router it so lots of storage in this boat huge table this table we redid it hinges down and a leg flips out and it fills up this section this cushion here slips out makes to like a full-size bed and then this kind of a fun bunk this is where my son sleeps you got to keep your feet in the hole there in order to fit so the head uh, we started redoing the head but we'll probably have to sell it as is the sinks new and the faucets new this door had a lot of damage so we painted it white and actually came out really really nice here's the piece of black sand for the other side of the boat and here's the V-Birth there's a lot of miscellaneous parts that are at my dad's house that I need to bring down all the doors the big doors here are at his house can use a little carpet in here I don't know why I didn't carpet that but I got this carpet locally I could tell you where, you, where to get it if you want to keep doing it if you want to carpet that section so I don't know what else to tell you about the boat I just don't have time to use it um, pretty confident that the motor runs well um, you know, I was down here for an hour cleaning up a little bit and it ran it for an hour the entire time ran perfect so anyway if you have any questions uh, give me a call you're welcome to come down and see the boat if you want and I guess that's it